such a climb. È così bello qui. This is where your order began? It began thousands of years ago, but here it was reborn. By the man you mentioned, Altair? Altair ibn Ahad. He built us up and set us free. He saw the folly of keeping a castle like this. It had become a symbol of arrogance and a beacon for all our enemies. And the mandate for menacing hoods? Was that his idea as well? <laughs> you mentioned a creed before. What is it? Nothing is true. Everything is permitted. That is rather cynical. It would be if it were doctrine. But it is merely an observation of the nature of reality. To say that nothing is true is to realize that the foundations of society are fragile and that we must be the shepherds of our own civilization. To say that everything is permitted is to understand that we are the architects of our actions and that we must live with their consequences, whether glorious or tragic. Do you regret your decision to live as an assassin for so long? I do not remember making that decision. This life, it chose me. For three decades, I have served the memory of my father and my brothers, and fought for those who have suffered the pain of injustice. I do not regret those years, but it is time to live for myself. The end of the road. What do you hope to find behind that door? Knowledge, above all else. Altair was a profound man and a prolific writer. He built this place as a repository for all his wisdom. He saw many things in his life, and learned many secrets, both troubling and strange. Knowledge that would drive lesser men to despair. Does that worry you? You had better come out of there alive. I plan to. Requiescat in pace, Altair. 